Hi, I'm Trev Hutchings, and this is my trick for removing the chipmunk effect when using the pitch shifter in BandLab to create backing vocal harmonies. Here, I have a vocal track, and I want to add some backing harmony vocals, pitched higher than the vocals. Hello, how are you? So I'm going to tap on the mixer settings icon, tap on the three dots on the vocal track header, and tap on duplicate. Then I'm going to double tap on the duplicate track header. Then tap on effects, tap on the plus icon, scroll through the tabs, and tap on the Pitch Shift tab. Then tap on Pitch Shifter. Now, for a simple backing harmony vocal track, I could drag the dot on the Shift slider all the way to the right. So the original vocals are shifted one octave higher. But if I tap on the Play icon, you can hear the backing harmony sounds like a chipmunk. So, in all honesty, it's pretty useless. Hello, how are you? So here, I have created this hack. So first, I'm going to tap on the delete icon to delete the pitch shifter. Then I'm going to tap on the plus icon, scroll through the tabs, and tap on the tone tab and then tap on Multi-Filter. Now the frequency here will depend on your vocals, but for my vocals, I'm going to drag the dot on the frequency slider to the left until it says about 165 Hz in the frequency text box. This will remove the frequencies that mainly cause the chipmunk effect. Then I'm going to drag the dot on the resonance slider all the way to the left. Now I'm going to tap on the plus icon again, scroll through the tabs, and tap on the Pitch Shift tab. Then tap on Pitch Shifter. Then I'm going to drag the dot on the shift slider all the way to the right. Now I'm going to tap on the plus icon again, scroll through the tabs, and tap on the tone tab. Then tap on EQ 3M. Now I'm going to drag the dot on the low slider all the way to the right and the dot on the high slider all the way to the right. And the dot on the mid slider all the way to the left. Now the mid sweep frequency will depend on your vocals. But for my vocals, I'm going to drag the dot on the mid sweep slider to the left until it says about 1800 hertz. The aim here is to remove any chipmunk effect on the lower frequency vocals. Finally, I'm going to tap on the back arrow and then tap on the X icon. Now, it's not perfect. For that, BandLab would need to add a format setting. But with the volume set correctly and pans the same as the main vocals, this is a lot more usable than without the hack. Hello, how are you? Hello, how are you? If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.